Hello everyone. Uh, this is the data recovery agreement I have just received from Dolphin Data Lab. We can see on the bottom sides we can collect two hard drives. This is one SATA port and this is another. And this is the power ports. And on the top side we can see here is one USB port. It is especially for the USB 3 port. And this one is for the COM port collector. And this one is the external power supply port. Okay, this is a hardware console. Now let's continue to check what other components are included in the package. This is one COM cable, and this is one COM connector. The connector contains the Samsung Seagate Crinton Western Digital Toshiba. So it is one all-in-one COM connectors. This one is often used when users needed to use the COM command board. Now let's move to Slext. Now we can see two hard drive power cables are included and two SATA data cables are also included. Okay, this one is the USB 3 cable. And there is also the external power supply cable. Now, let's try to connect them correctly together. Firstly, we can see we have put two hard drives and we can connect them first. Connect the data cable. Now connect the power cable. When we just want to image one hard drive or recover one hard drive or do some COM HDD repair to one hard drive, then this is okay. But sometimes, in order to enhance our HDD repair or data recovery efficiency, we can collect two hard drives. Okay, again the data cable power cable okay down so right now, you can check, we have connect two hard drives to the DDP. Next, we can connect the USB 3 cable, because DDP is one USB 3 data recovery equipment. So, in order to operate on the DDP, we need to connect the USB cable. On the top side, we can see, here is one USB 3 port. Now let's insert it. Finally, let's supply power to the DDP. Here is one external power supply cable. Here 
insert it. Okay, we can see the LED flashes. Until now, we have almost completed the collection, the DDP, and the hard drives we are going to operate on. Sometimes we may need to collect the COM cable as well. This is used when we need to access the COM command mode and repair some COM failures using commands. We can try to demo to you how to collect it. First, we need to find the COM collect port on the DDP. Here is the COM port on the DDP. Now insert it. On the hard drive, we need to find the COM port as well. Okay, this collector is for Seagate SATA hard drives. Now, Seagate, this one is the COM collection points. Now, we use the COM collector to collect it. So it's very convenient. Okay. If users want to collect a lot of cable to a lot of drive, it's the same idea. Now we can check this one. We have finished all possible collections. So you got to see, it's very easy, right? Thank you.